Alright, what's up everybody? It's your boy NJ Trip. Doing actually another reaction video. And this one comes from most amazing top ten. It's a very great great video, uh great launch channel here on YouTube and they give you the they give you like these most amazing top ten list of things. And I've got two videos for you. The very first one we're gonna do is the top ten insane American laws that actually exist. So let's go ahead, let's check this out. And welcome back to you most amazing thank you guys all of you most amazing subscribers for coming on back video after video i'm rebecca felgate and today i'm talking about the top 10 insane american laws that actually exist i'm from england where we do have a few pretty crazy laws ourselves but spotlight is on you today america coming in at number 10 you cannot talk with pirates jeez america way to ruin dreams of sailing the seven seas with a johnny depp like sidekick but actually way cooler than johnny depp because he's gone really, really wrong. Not talking to pirates is a federal law. 18 USC code 1657 makes it a federal crime to consult with a known pirate. So seamen, listen up. To be fair, when you read this law, it kind of makes sense. Pirates are referred to as robbers of the sea, so really the law is saying you can't make deals with sea robbers. If you do talk to pirates, you can be fined or receive a maximum of three years in jail. Coming in at number nine, it's illegal to fall asleep with your shoes on in North Dakota. I've only ever fallen asleep with my shoes on once. It was after my graduation from university and to be totally fair, falling asleep with one's shoes on is pretty much just a sign that they're absolutely drunk. Or maybe even possibly homeless, which is a bit sad. Nonetheless, there could be many upstanding citizens that simply nod off on the bus or the train home. Unless those shoes are removed, they're breaking a weird and kind of unreasonable law. I'm on the fence about number eight. In Maine, it's illegal to keep your Christmas decorations up past January the 14th. Basically, the state of Maine will allow you an eight-day grace period in removing your Christmas lights. It is traditional to keep lights up until around January the 6th, the 12th day of Christmas. My mom always told me it was bad luck to keep them up after that date, but in Maine, the law of bad luck obviously wasn't enough to scare residents. They needed the law of, I guess, the law. So if you're watching in Maine, you know when to ditch your decorative Santas. Classic at number seven, guns don't kill people, kinder eggs do. Wait, what? The 1938 Food, Drug and Cosmetic Act embargoes kinder eggs, stopping them from entering the USA. Why? Well, because the chocolate contains a hard plastic capsule with a toy in it. It's basically like a little Easter egg. It seems that while other dubious things are not banned in the States, these eggs are considered a risk to children. Smuggling in a kinder egg can get you a hefty fine of $1,200 per egg, so better not show this to border control. Kinder eggs! Coming in at number six, you cannot make unreasonable noises in the Pentagon. Title 32 of the Code of Federal Regulations, Part 234, says that a person cannot make a noise that is unreasonable in the Pentagon, which, what? Is not entirely sure what they mean by a reasonable noise and an unreasonable noise. The literature makes it seem as if a person is basically not acting like a normal person is expecting to act, then it's against the law. So basically, you can't be weird in the Pentagon. This wouldn't be allowed. Or this. Beep. Did it beep beep against the law in the Pentagon? There we go. Fact. Throwing it up at number five, it is against the law to make fake onion rings. 21 USC code 333 and 21 CFR code 102.39 make it a crime to sell onion rings from a diced onion. What's even worse is if they sell these onion rings from diced onions, they need to advertise them as diced onions, not onion rings. I feel like I've said onion ring a lot. I feel like this is a really weird law, and I for one am wondering what the catalyst was that sparked the creation of this law. We are still at number four. Cutting down a cactus will get you jail time in Arizona. That's right, leave those cacti alone. In fact, cutting down a saguaro cactus can get you a maximum sentence of 25 years in prison. In some places, this is a life sentence for a cactus. In 2014, a teenage boy was arrested in Scottsdale, Arizona for cutting the arm off a regular cactus. Okay, coming in at number three, you cannot live on a boat in Georgia. 
Georgia. What? The houseboat is the literal dream for me. There are plenty of lakes and the Atlantic in the American state of Georgia, but it's against the law to live on a boat for longer than 30 days. Luckily, this law did actually get more lenient a couple of years ago, but these days you do still need to apply for a special permit if you want to spend time living at sea or on a lake, which to me is weird. One of my favorite and most ridiculous laws I've ever heard, in New York City, you cannot have puppets in windows. Section 10 to 114 of the city's administrative code prevents puppets from being displayed in windows. It's illegal for any puppet show, ballet, or dancing to take place in any window, which again leads me to wonder what sparked the creation of this law. Mountain Dew even made a video about police raiding a guy's house who was performing a puppet show to the street from his window. The more you know, hey. Finally, at number one, Georgia is back at it again, and this time they have company. It's illegal to carry an ice cream cone in your back pocket in three states. Why? Why is this a thing? In Alabama, it's illegal all of the time, but in Georgia and New York, they're cool with it, apart from on a Sunday when they're absolutely not cool with it, which makes it even weirder. Why anyone would even want to carry an ice cream in their back pocket is beyond me anyway. It sounds like a messy butt disaster waiting to happen. So there we have it, that was 10 insane American laws that actually exist. Some of these are pure cray, others make a tiny shred of sense, but I do have one more for you that makes no sense at all. Some humans can't marry other humans they love in 13 states. Still, liberate those hearts and also get those puppets back in those windows. You know it makes sense. Thank you guys for tuning into this episode of Most Amazing Top 10. I'm Rebecca Felgate. If you like this video, please give it a thumbs up and share it with a friend and stay subscribed for more Most Amazing videos. I'll see you next time. Still watching? Here are two more videos you will love. Check out the top 10 people who lived out insane prison sentences and the top 10 laws you didn't know you were breaking. That was just ridiculous, man. Just ice cream cones in your back pocket on a Sunday, puppets in a window. The cactus, I want to understand that the cactus because Arizona, because I, 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 I kind of understand that one. But man, all of those are just nuts. <laughs> really, it really is just kind of all types of stupid. So, anyway. That's why it's the most amazing top 10, right? It's the most amazing things ever seen. My heavens. Uh, post your comments down below to me what you guys thought. To me what you guys thought of that. That's, do you know any weird laws or weird things from the states or countries that you're from? Post them down in the comment section. Like the video, share the video, subscribe to the channel. And as always, thank you so much for watching. This is your boy AJ Tripp signing off. As always, be good to each other, y'all. Be careful out there. And I am out. Have mercy.